Drew's heir. What's the... Who Drew's heir? I don't know who's that. What if it last? It sounds like it would be a great idea. No? Good evening. Hi, Pai. Hi, evening. Kelly. Long Hi. time no see, everyone. Hi, Trixie. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Hi, Bethlehem. Can I, do you mind if I get some more? Yeah, sure. Hello, hello. Long time no see. Hi, Malen. Hi, Laika. Let me move this camera more so I can see you. I can you see them right there. Half lane face mode. Yeah, behind yeah, there. No, and again, you're nicer to look at. Hello, 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 hello everyone. Good evening. Hi, Matt. Hi, Arlene. Hi, hi. Hello, hello. Let me send back my. Your name is Math. That is a unique name. Your favorite subject. <laughs> Everyone's favorite subject. Absent hi, Carla. Send back plug. Hello. Carla Ligraphy. Hi, Abdu. Hi, my son. Abdu Sashar. Sharon. Hi Liz. Hi. Hi. Hi Dal from hi. Bethlehem. Hi. Hello Bethlehem. Math. Math stands for mus uh, mus musician, artist musician, ah. artistic, talented, and happy. Ha -ha. I love it. I hate math subject. <laughs> but you so love you art. Math. <laughs> I like hi that. Hazel. Hello. Hi, Rampel. Where's Rampel? There on Insta uh, on Facebook. Facebook. What up, Rampel? Long time, buddy. Hope you're well. Hi. Where is he? I don't see his name. They're red. Oh, it's, it's red. Oh, okay. Hi, Suzette. Red kapala, red. Hi, Lucky. And the mom is Kim. Maraming salamat. Hi, Lucky. Hazel. Hi. Lifestyle guru. Hello. Okay, so maybe we can start? Yeah, okay. Okay, so we're going to tackle or share a little of our knowledge about ADF or alternate day fasting. And dopamine fasting. Oh, and do okay. But you're an expert with that because uh, Not really. you've done it. You've done a semi dopamine dopamine Dop dopamine fast. I did two weeks. So I just came from well not but two weeks ago I did two weeks. A two week long smartphone fast. So I have an injury where I can't really move my I mean I should not be doing movements where I race stay in prolonged positions that will hurt my ulnar nerve. So and plus, I noticed my screen time on my phone was about five hours, which daily. was ridiculous. Yeah, daily. And on top of that, I wanted to kickstart some habits, some positive habits. So I switched to my old phone. I'll show you guys. Not old phone. Hi, Thea. Oh, you're going to get your, what do you call that? Dummy phone? No, I'm not dummy phone. Well, not dummy phone, but like an old. My dumb phone. <laughs> there you go. So I, I bought a cheap Nokia. And I used this for about two weeks and it was awesome until I had to... So, quick recap, the only time I did not like uh, having to use a dumb phone was when I had to go out and I had to scan QR codes with my big iPad. I thought that was ridiculous. So, and if I needed, a, um, I needed to use an app for my two-factor authentication, like... Uh, one of those banking apps or stock apps. All, also as well, transferring cash was pretty much not happening. But yes, sleep was fantastic. So smartphone fasting, if you guys can do it. It's hard. Yeah, it's my, hard. my sleep improved. I felt it. I, I would sleep faster and I started 
um, I was able to kickstart a lot of habits. I started drawing again, but I stopped again. So yeah, it, it's hard, but if you guys wanna take a quick dopamine fast, I highly recommend it. It's really challenging though, yeah. because we are all now working from home and yeah. you, you know, you need to communicate with people and all of that, so, but well, yeah. One of my favorite um, quotes is, uh, when Elon Musk was interviewed by Joe Rogan and he said that basically we are all cyborgs already meaning we are part machine already it's just that the computer is still in our pocket and I felt that I felt that when I I got off my smartphone for two weeks I was like oh I need my smartphone I need to do I need to bank parang it's part of you really sometimes of you. I I see him yeah parang I noticed you one time you were trying to get something in your pocket but your phone is not there because you I think <laughs> missed na naka dopamine ka fast yeah. so but you you want to talk about ADF? Oh yeah so okay. let's uh yeah let's jump uh and talk about jump into the topic and hi, talk chef. about hi ADF oh, so chef, chef. Hi, chef. hello chef. Uh, hello Sha. thank you for your awesome food chef so let's talk about ADF or alternate day fasting. Siguro it would be nice if they throw questions or you would want to yeah, start. I think, I think you guys can maybe ask questions about ADF. While we're waiting for the questions, yeah, we can talk about yeah. what it is. So a again, ADF stands for alternate day fasting. It can be a 24-hour alternate day fast. Or some people do a 36 hours back-to-back back to back so for example um 24 hours no food and then thir uh, and then or 36 hours without food and then they will feast and then fast again so okay hey you can start so uh i don't have a lot of experience AD with adf i've done it uh i've done it probably the longest i've been able to do alternate day fasting was for Three weeks. Um, That's before we met. Before we mm -hmm. met. Okay. Right before we met, actually. And then the most recent one I've done is just one week, um, 36 hours. Last week, actually, I did it. Um, and I'm going to do it again this week. So, what is ADF? ADF is breaking up instead of one contiguous long fast, um, let's say three, five days, seven days, you do it every other day and uh, the protocol I'm I like doing is the 36 hour well I don't like doing it personally the 36 hour for me the 36th hour is when I feel that's when I'm just about to enter my flow I'm going to feel comfy um, where I won't be hungry I won't be hangry I won't be ir irritable hungry. but every time I'm just about to enter that where I'm, I'm I can chill, we break it, and I eat, and I have to force myself to start over again. So I actually prefer to do the 24 hour. Now, the reason I'm doing that, what the benefit of it is, in a way, it's also better if you're active. If you're, if you like to work out or you're sporty and you wanna, um, you wanna continue to train, you don't want fasting to get in the way of your training, you can still you can do it with the alternative fast. You can um, just have black coffee or tea. What's the tea you make for me? Oh, the hibiscus tea. Yeah, it's fantastic. Yeah. And so it's basically it's my my other buddy does it. He does twenty three hours. So it's almost OMAD. So he's actually cheating. But so there's that variant. Um, there's a girl online for inspiration you can check out who's been doing it for two years, and she does I think uh, thirty six. 30 hour fast every time. Her name is Rachel Sharp. So she's a new tube. Yeah, you can check and her can, out. Yeah, amazing transformation. And she's she's been able to sustain that. Um, and from the videos of her that, that I've seen, at a certain point she did plateau. So she was very obese. She got her weight down and then she hit the point where she wasn't exercising. Um, and she had the plateau and then she, she had to start modifying her diet and then when she started exercising she had to eat more calories um, 
and adjust to her training schedule. But still, two years of alternate day fasting and uh, dramatic transformation. So yeah, okay, questions. Okay, questions. Uh, sagutin muna natin yung about EDF. So, okay. is it different uh, from IF and alternate fa fasting, Trisha? Hi, Wait. Annika. I see Annika. There's Annika. <laughs> Hi, Annix. So, yes, Trisha. So, intermittent fasting, um, usually it's a, sh a shorter period, you know, like 16 hours, 14, 14 to 18 hours. And then, alternate day naman would be 24 hours minimum. Ganun siya. Yeah. For, for me, the real alternate day fast is you skip a day. So, if your last meal, let's say it's um, Saturday today, my last meal, let's say it's at 8 p.m. And then, I won't break it tomorrow at 9 p.m. Instead, I'll really skip the entire day tomorrow and eat on Monday, Monday morning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, I find that I have better results there, but yeah. I find it's also harder. 36 hours is kind of yeah, challenging, no? Um, Carla, can you consume matcha green tea during the fasting? As long as it's the one from the yung naka tea bag. Kung naka tea bag siya and make sure walang sugar. Because I noticed, I think I've mentioned this already uh, from our previous live. Meron ng mga tea ngayon na pag chinek mo, merong sweetener yung tea. So ideally, uh, walang any um sweeteners para talagang hindi mabreak yung fast mo. So, if it's a tea bag, tea, then it's fine. But I would also recommend that avoid anything with caffeine um, 3 p.m. onwards so it will not, para it will not disrupt your, or, yeah, yung, yung tulog, pagtulog sa gabi. Also, I recommend you do not do, you do not pair it with a dehydrating diet. So my mistake last week was I was switching to the carnivore diet. So because of my injury, because I, I have this ulnar nerve on, in carpal tunnel on my both arms, I haven't been, I'm not allowed to exercise, I'm not allowed to work out. So nothing where I strain my arms, even a plank, I'm not supposed to do push-ups or even just a simple plank and keep my arms straight. So instead I'm trying to manipulate my diet so that I don't, don't get too fat. Um, yeah, so my, my point is, the 30, I lost my point, 36 hours mm -hmm. is where I find that I, it's a sweet spot for um, for maintaining that caloric deficit. But I do get dehydrated from that and I, what I, sorry, my point was I paired it up with a carnivore diet. Carnivore diet. Carnivore diet. And I, that's also dehydrating. So... Because, uh, so the reason, just to, ahead, yeah, to add up on that, um, just to... The reason why you get dehydrated um, with the carnivore diet um, because protein is actually thermogenic and it's warm. So when the body goes through a transition, it's like keto. So there's that certain effect na parang it's, you keep on peeing as well during the transition. So you have to make sure that when you're on a carnivore diet, you're really hydrated. And yeah, knowing you sometimes... <laughs> yeah, so, so I, I have to remind him. I had to break it because I could feel my lymph node was hurting from the dehydration already. So um, be careful if you pair it with a, a harsh diet. I mean, a diet that dehydrates you already. From Sha, can can we do an alternate day broth fast instead of water fast? Yes, it's doable. Actually, um, some people you can share the five hundred calories about okay. EDF. So Atticus will discuss about it. So there are some people that can. My, the, instead of completely fasting during the your fasting day, you just ingest five hundred calories. Uh, my sister had fantastic um, results results with this. She she would do alternate day fasting, but in not the true fast. Instead, she would just cut down to five hundred calories. How many times a week? Twice. MWF ata or three times a week. Basta alternate, parang alternate day. I can't remember exactly. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that works too. Um, I haven't tried that. I actually want to try it. <laughs> Parang sa akin mas mahirap yung deficit eh, for some reason. Yeah, because it triggers your appetite. Yeah, but yeah, if it, if it can work for you, then that you know that's better. But deficit pa rin dapat. 
Yeah. Yeah. So five hundred only. Five hundred lang, because you can actually burn that by just you know building. So a funny example we have noted here is um that's one Big Mac. One uh, actually one Big Mac is over five hundred calories. It's at five fifty calories. Just remove the bread on <laughs> one bread. I yeah, think one, that will half half. half, half, half yeah. Uh -oh. How many hours do you recommend for those who have experienced intermittent fasting but kind of a beginner for water fasting? 24 hours, start with that. Um, 20, 23 hours, so you switch to basically an OMAD first. If OMAD gets easy for you, then you can start pushing it to 30, 36. So what it, OMAD is, usually OMAD, they do the 23. Yeah, 23 hours fast and yeah. then one hour eating window. Yeah. The There's a question hour. here from Via. Is it better to calorie count on non-fasting days on if on ABF? Um, no, Via, because there's a certain point when you do an extended fast that uh, it can actually lower your basal metabolic rate or your resting metabolic rate, and you don't want that. So if you're already doing, if you're already on a, an extended alternate day fasting or extended fasting i would not recommend that you eat calorie count on your feeding day however i would suggest that you eat nutrient dense food para your para your well nourished especially after a long fast lucky hope do you believe in covid vaccines huh. that's a great question uh, well you know i I like to keep an open mind and I, I study both the conspiracy part and I've, I've seen a lot of videos. I have an uncle who is vehemently against vaccination and feels it's part of a Rough. pandemic. Um, so my strategy is I, I don't know because I see scientists talking about how it's actually not good for you. My, my opinion on that is to stay in the center and um, weigh my risks basically like how i would invest in the stock market where do where's the the lowest risk and the truth is uh i'd rather risk um dying from vaccine than uh than the virus so that's that that's me but i i, I don't recommend that for anyone else <laughs> francis I love your FMD plan, by the way. Maraming salamat. Ch Chalarian of Peyton. Hi, Kim. Kamusta na? Say hi sa buong family. Hi. Hello. Rampel, how long do you usually do ADF a week? A month or alternate, alternating frequencies? Um, Depending on your weight and health goals if you're planning if you have an insulin problem or if you have diabetes or anything that you would want to reverse minor health condition um you can do an alternate day fasting for a month and see how you feel or try a short you know like a week or two and see how you how you feel after So Rampa, that girl, Rachel Sharp that I mentioned, she kept at it because two she years, found... Two years, no? Yeah, two years. It, it was what worked for her, so... But she's really, like, obese, no? Yeah. 200 something. Isn't Rampa in great shape? Rampa? Yeah. Atticus is asking. So no, you, you don't need to probably do it very long. <laughs> we don't you think you need to do a two-year ADF, but <laughs> maybe try a week first, you know, start from there, and then once you get your momentum, then fill it out and see. I am Red Deber. That's That's, that's Rampo. Yeah. Oh, he's on Instagram too. Okay. Yeah. Trisha. What do you eat when you are not fasting, if it's alternate? In my case, I paired it with a carnivore diet, which is just protein. Organic protein. So, eggs, bacon, mm -hmm. steak, fish. Um, yeah, that, that's me. So, that's, I, I wanted to keep my calorie low and I, did, I was deliberate about not spiking my insulin. So, what usually happens is that if uh, I fast and then I do something like I eat rice or, or something sweet and that will spike my insulin, that's not 
also ideal. Um, do you feel weird? Like, do you remember any time that you've done that and you felt, you know? No, I was young back then. I, I used to do that. I mean, I did not. Uh, before I met Kim, I used to do uh, long water fast, like, well, medium length water fast, 10 days. And then the first meal I'd have would be bulalo, uh, not bulalo, um, beef stew with rice. Nilaga. Nilaga, Nilaga and or, isang kaldero ng rice. Like, yeah. <laughs> Loved it. <gasps> Mahilig to then magnum. I, 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 oh I, I, I it was pretty. It was terrible. Three pieces of magnum. Pag bata ka kaya pa, no? Yeah. I was in my 30s then, so yeah. Yeah. Well. Uh, Rampel. Not anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> yeah. I wish. I wish you could say How does it affect your... From Rain Monty. How does it affect work? Like, if you do a lot of reading and writing. Actually, I'll... You wanna share your Go, you first, yeah. you first. So I <laughs> um honestly before when I do like long fast or longer fast I feel that my mind is like there's more mental clarity but after I did because just to share, I'm going to share it here. So um we've done can't see you. There. Uh, we did an IVF procedure, so basically egg retrieval lang. Um, well, you shared it here. <laughs> so, I, I wasn't talking about it, so I wasn't, I was absent online. If you notice, I wasn't posting anything lately because I was, I felt terrible and I felt like up to now, I'm still recovering. <laughs> and like, it's so weird. Um, Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to elaborate that. But to answer your question, right now, um, I'm recovering. So I don't want to push it. Um, my fast for me is now okay. And I'm studying and I'm busy. And there's so much stress going on. But if I'm not in any, like, if I am, I'm not, free, I'm free of any procedure or if hindi ako nag retrieval, I think I'd be okay to push it so Wait, there's that what is the question um kung ka, yeah. Yeah, yeah so iba iba it depends sa state mo depends sa level ng stress mo if you're happy while studying and you're not so stressed i think it's doable but for for me ah, good fat or fat fast is also ideal when you're studying so what is fat fast you can check babe aspray or you can read his book, um, Fast This Way. That will actually help you. Can I, wait, can I answer that? Okay, yeah, go ahead. So, in my case, I... The first 24 hours is easy. Um, and my, my sleep the first day is easy. But I find the second night is hard. And if I'm doing work... Um, bad sleep snowballs and, and creates a domino, a negative domino effect. So uh, that's the only thing I did not like when I was trying it last week. But I'm going to make adjustments. I'm going to change my diet. I'll probably switch to a keto type of diet during my feeding days. So, and I'll take melatonin on the fasting days to help me sleep. Uh, yeah, so I'm making minor adjustments, minor tweaks, but otherwise, the uh, mind sharp, no issues. It's just if I mess up my sleep, then it's a problem. Yeah, iba talaga pag puyat. And yeah. you'll also notice this, no? Um, the more na puyat ka, the more mahirap kumain ng healthy and the more mahirap magfast, de ba? Kasi the body will try to find strength to go through the day. So usually talagang, yeah, maglalaban yung katawan. So rest is really a must. Hi, Hannah! Twish, tips to curb appetite cravings on eating days. So basically, just eat, incorporate more good fat, and don't be afraid because fat will not make you fat. It is being registered or used, sorry, as fuel. It's the excessive refined carbohydrates or processed carbohydrates that can actually be registered as fat, or you can store it as fat. Especially if sedentary ka. Rampel, true puyat. Super. Pag puyat. Ano, nung bata ako, 
Parang kahit puyat ka, walang problema, no? But, kala mo, tanda ko na yun. Pero no, 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 I really felt it after having three kids. Ewan ko, ah, like, I feel like parang mas woman kasi you have three kids. But strength-wise, I need to think about that. Parang, parang ano, mas malis mapagod. Or dahil maingay lang talaga palagi. Yeah. Alam mo yun, parang draining. But, <laughs> I'm not complaining. I'm just saying. <laughs> okay. Like, uh, not really a question about ADF, but I'd really like to know if pregnant women can fast. I used to fast, but now being pregnant, I fast not on purpose. I have bad case of GERD. Hi, Laika. If you're currently pregnant, I would not recommend that you do an intermittent fasting. I don't think that would be the best um, or ideal Uh, thing to do, especially that you have a growing baby inside your tummy. What you can do instead is eat nutrient dense, nutritious food, and focus on whole food so you can manage your weight while you're pregnant. And even if you have GERD, if you eat whole food, actually, hindi yan mati trigger. Nati trigger ang ating um, gastric ulcer or stomach issues kapag ang pagkain natin is heavy on processed food sugar and refined carbohydrates. Hold on, did, didn't you do IF when you were pregnant with strong? I was, but I will not recommend it. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> it is not something that you should do if you're not familiar with it. Okay. I have been doing it ever since, so I'm used to it. Yeah. But for someone, uh, you know, pregnant and we don't know. But she know, said she was experienced. She, she has fasting experience. I, well, it also, de- sorry, it also depends kung ano yung kinakain niya, darling. Kasi, okay baka intermittent fasting but not super clean the diet so that can be an issue don't copy me because you know <laughs> it's i'm a different uh i have a different belief so there's that i do meet micro fasting maybe around 12 hours to 14 hours but not like 24 hours fast i, I did not do that no just to clarify okay sorry <laughs> that's too much you have a growing baby you need fat for brain development too. Katie, at what age did you start fasting? I'd say siguro, inter- without knowing it, I was, because I was never a breakfast person, so I'd say teenager pa lang. Um, but yung alam ko na na nagpa-fast ako, siguro 20-ish, early 20s. How about you? Well, alternate day fasting, I don't do it regularly. I do. I like to do longer, medium to small, 3 to 11, 14 day long fasts on my own. KT's, KTRCP, so mga a decade na. Yan. Yeah, ako more than a decade already. Alam mo yung age mo? Oh Three God. decades ba? 10 years <laughs> old palang nagpa fast na siya. Joke. Kidding. Malen, thoughts What's on. What's your first dieting? Hi, hi, Malen. What do you mean by reverse dieting, and for how long? T, T Christine, I am ha- having weight problem for since last year. Been doing OMAD for the past three mm. weeks, and I feel nothing is happening. Do you recommend na that I book consultation with you? Na getting frustrated. Hi, Christine. There are several factors that we need to check. Um, yeah, do you take anything outside the meal plan? Um, is this the 800 calories meal plan? Have you been dieting prior to your OMAD? Because baka we need to check your basal metabolic rate and your resting metabolic rate. Baka sobrang baba na from dieting, kaya hindi na nag effect yung mga pag-tweak mo or nag-plateau ka na with your uh, weight loss. Like, uh, you're welcome. I, Kyrom MC Queen. Ken, I like you guys. Super real and informative. Thank you. Thank you. Carrie Leash. Thoughts on carnivore diet? I'm a believer. <laughs> Personally, I love the carnivore diet. I'm a believer of a carnivore diet. But here's the thing. Ito kasi yung pinakamahirap doon, Ads, no? Um, 
Ano yun, Kim? <laughs> yung love. Yung carnivore diet kasi yung concept niya is from head to tail. So, what does it, what does it mean? Hindi mo pwedeng piliin lang yung part ng meat ng kaka- na kakainin mo. So, pwede kang gumawa ng broth mo from head to tail, buong parts. Kailangan, kailangan all organic yan. And then, kailangan initially magsusupplement ka kasi because of per- diuretic, tama ba? Diuretic, diuretic. diuretic effect siya. So, parang ihi ka ng ihi. Like keto diet, basically, no? First week, parang mag matatanggalan ka ng water retention. So, magiging leaner ka. Um, but yun nga, sabi nga ni Ats, medyo dehydrated yung feeling. So, you just have to read up on it. I would recommend that you check on Paul Saladino. Check, I've read his book three times already, Carnivore Code. Um, there's Sean, science. Sean Baker? And Sean Baker, yeah. And there's science in it. It's it's really promising. Yun lang talaga ang problema natin, especially here in the Philippines. Medyo mahal pa yung sources ng organic produce, no? So, um, yeah, but I'd say it's one of the best. And fascinating, I need to reconfirm this information. Uh, don't quote me for this, but parang I've read somewhere na, oh, there you go, naalala ko na, si Maria Emmerich. Yeah. So, she's also a nutritionist and she's known for um, her uh, protein, basically carnivore diet. No? So, she's an advocate, advocate as well of carnivore diet. Um you know mo ko, bakit? Uh-oh. So, um, I lost my trust. Okay, so yon. Um, basically, sinasabi niya na, this is so, super opposite of, you know, kasi we're also promoting plant-based diet, vegetarian, and so on. So many types of diet. But, one thing that capture, captured, uh, that I've captured sa mga writing, or write-ups niya, and sa study na shinare niya is, yung tao, parang malaki yung colon natin. So, pag malaki daw yung colon ng, ng, ng mammal or ng animal, it means that that mammal or animal or person, human in short, is meant to consume more animal protein. But I need to verify that. So, don't quote me for this. I need to double check. That's how I understood her. Um, and then, um, yeah, that's it. So, basically, for, for fermentation, vegetables in short um konti lang yung kailangan nating vegetable more of the protein so yun yung idea doon but i need to double check cuz ayo kung sabihin na yun dapat yun ang dapat gawin but personally i i like it i like keto diet and um carnivore diet more than the only thing i, I did not like vegetarian. about the carnivore diet, diet is uh, after about a month how long did i do it for a month yeah, it starts to get pretty boring Wala, nabore na, yeah, uh, na, na siya. Yeah. Pero may mga tao na, y- you know what? Ito pa, fascinating. Because I was reading uh, Maria Emmerich's book also. Sorry, out of ano na, ADF. But just to share also. Ang ganda rin nung, ano eh, nung mga effects. Like, it can reverse autoimmune diseases. It can reverse diabetes. It can reverse a lot of, you know, basic... um illnesses na feeling natin hindi kayang ma-reverse. Um, and contrary, tama ba? Okay, contrary. Yeah, Contra- contrary. Contrary sa sinasabi nila na um, makakonstipate ka daw sa carnivore. Parang you just have to be patient and oh. it will take, parang uh, mag-adjust lang yung system, system, system mo, yung chan mo, yung gut mo. But eventually, you'll get a ve- very healthy bowel movement. So, yeah, ito, actually, what's your experience, mother? That's, that's the initiation phase of the carnivore diet. There's a point, uh, maybe about week two, where you will have the, the carnivore runs. <laughs> carnivore so runs. So, you'll have diarrhea and... As in diarrhea. As in diarrhea. Um, Joe Rogan talks about it on his podcast, uh, where you're just... Um, it's like everything's coming out. Uh, sorry, it's pretty graphic, but it's actually because of the quarantine, the lockdown. Oh, it's gonna, the camera's gonna fall. What happened? It it's it's, it's ideal for now. I mean, it works well, but uh, if you had to go to the office every day and you're on a carnivore diet, and be forewarned. So be careful. Yeah. Hi, Rose. Hi, John. You're so pretty. Thank you. Ah. 
reverse dieting, max calories to normalize. Yes, that's correct. That's correct, Malen. That's what we're talking about, actually, to boost or to revamp your or boost your basal metabolic rate. So, Malen, what's your question again? Uh, reverse dieting, max calories to normalize. The we metabolism. understand reverse dieting is when you ramp up your calorie after fasting. Yeah, that's well, that's how you ramp it up. But you cannot be on a long term super high calorie because now your satiating your your satiating hormone will require more so parang pag mag adjust ka hindi ka na satisfied sa, sa lighter meal so there is that also KTC, KTRCP also experienced plateau before so I did a 72 yep, hour fast that yeah that works and keep doing 72s as much as you want John and Rosaline, is it true that water fasting is bad if you have endometriosis? I am not well versed with this, so I would not uh, give a suggestion. Um, maybe you can consult your doctor and and see and you know listen to her, her thoughts about it. If there's anything I can help you with after your consultation to your doctor, let me know. So, can I opine on that? Yeah, sure. Um, Water fasting does not cure. It, it is not it is not a magical cure. What it does is it allows your system to clean up. So think of water fasting as your uh, your Maria Kondo for your body. For your body. Maria, so Maria Kondo, ba? Something Kondo, right? Uh -uh. The Kondo method, the Japanese the girl. Cleaning, the cleaning. Well, yeah. she organizes everything, cleans out the junk. And because your, your body is clean and organized, uh, you're healing capabilities function better so that's that's the, how I view water fasting it's basically I'm allowing the body to be uh, to have less to focus on what it needs yeah, to less clean. distraction yeah Maria Kondo right yeah Alex and Ale Al Alex Alex and the ZXS <laughs> is broad fasting okay for Oh, sir, yes, it is safe to take. Lilac MD, where do you get your organic produce? So several suppliers, we have BioAugs, um, before Pomora, we have Real Food, actually madame. Can you send us a DM and then we'll send you our suppliers. Cindy, ang guapo ni Sir Atticus, thank you. Wow, thank you, ah. <laughs> Carla. Marie Kondo. Marie Kondo, Marie. thank you. John Conmarie. Yes. I am Katrina. Himalayan salt. The Rojas. I want to ask if that Himalayan salt is the pink one that I saw. Hi, Katrina. Yes. But be careful also. Kindly check the label. Because right now, because I'm yung Himalayan salt, there are many people who are fake Himalayan salt. Really? Yeah, they color it. And it's so sad. Yeah, so just check. Just make sure that it's real. Buy, so buy it from a reputable yeah, brand. What's yeah. the brand we use? We use real salt. R-E-A-L salt. I can get it now. Downstairs. Oh. Sige. Pakuha. Sige, pakuha mo para makita nila. Sorry. Mababa ka pa. Hi, everyone. Grabe, I, I'm, I miss talking to people. Books na lang, laging kausap, and family, I mean, my kids and my husband. But I hope everyone is doing well. Hintayin natin si Atticus, kinukuha niya lang yung asin. <laughs> yung Himalayan so Ano pa ba kung hindi na sasagot? Hold on. Yeah, currently do, doing OMAD and I'm in ketosis, but I think I fell into a plateau. Is it okay to do try FMD or, or alternate alternate fasting for weight loss? How will it how will it affect my ketosis if you do a longer um, fasting? But sorry, if you're on 
a keto or OMAD diet, I would recommend to do a broth fast so you have your days where you do a 500 or just broth for like two to three cups. Pasok pa rin yan for your ADF. Um, unless gusto mo mag full on just water, water fast for, or for an extended uh, period of your fasting, you'll still get into ketosis with that. Trixie, this is so random, but do you have any study tips? Hi, Trixie, what do you mean? Oh, I love that question. Oh, study tips, uh, <laughs> literal like study tips. That's, that's random. Like for me, I usually wake up early because that's when, you know, the house is quiet. Do you have kids? If not, uh, then, you, you know, for me, ever since madaling araw eh, hindi ko alam bakit. Because it's so quiet, alam mo yun? Yeah, that's the first yeah. step. Can I share? I, yeah, I sure. Ito, so, mahilig mag-aral din to. I'm still studying, always studying. My favorite is, yeah, first, you need um, quiet time with no distraction. Especially in, that includes not just family members, but even your phone. So notifications and all of that, it disrupts your ability to go deep. Uh, the next one, yeah, the next one I like to do is, um, I like to do an initial scan first get the lay of the land, try to understand what I'm studying, and then I'll ask questions. So let's say I'm studying about, yeah, let's say I'm studying about, um, pick a topic, let's say alternate day fasting. I would ask myself the questions first, what do I need to know about this topic? Hi darling, you want to join us? Storm, come in. Come in, come in, come in, you can sit down beside me. So the kids just woke up. Come here, come here. They just woke up, so they we went so out to do a camping, kasi so medyo kuyat sila. To, tonight late ang dinner natin, so we will eat after. Wait, can, can you show show them something after. that Storm can do? So I'm pretty proud of this Storm. Which one? Okay. Storm. Okay. What are your macros? Protein, fat, carbohydrates. Very yeah. good. High five. Is sugar good for you? No. Okay. Good. That's, that's all that's all I want to hear. <laughs> no, sorry, peace. Okay, so this is one red mond, real salt. This is my favorite. And then we have this also from Nater Natiera Himalal Himalanya Fine Pink Salt. Kita ba? Yeah. And then we have this also. Natural tide sea salt. So yeah. Nin yung mga salt. Yo, that's her salt. Tapos, wait lang. My question pa. Hi, Miss Kim. From Trisha. If you are first time, if first time to fast, water fast, how many days per week? You can try doing. Siguro, 24 hours yeah, 24 first. hours first. So, first, last meal at 4 p.m. and then break it the following day at 4 to 5 p.m. So, OMAD first. And yeah. Then if that's easy, it's you can yun. skip an entire day. Yep. I've been doing intermittent fasting for a long time, although the do, do weight loss, my belly looks the same. What do you recommend to lose belly fat? Maybe try doing an extended water fast first. And what's your diet like? Like, what do you usually eat? Also, you need to check sometimes if there are um, food intolerances. Because sometimes, without knowing, that's what, what's making you feel bloated as well. Trixie, thanks for the tips. I'm at my last year in college, so I really want to give it all my all for the last hurrah. Go, go, go! Yeah, go. How much Himalayan salt for 500 ml? So, what is around? you can add one fourth teaspoon of Himalayan salt. It's Carissa. I've just purchased your jelly broth. How many times do you recommend broth fasting per month? Depending on your goal um, for weight loss, you can do an alternate day broth fast. You can do a two day broth fast, three day broth fast every week or every two weeks. Joan, me too. I did IF before, but my belly remained fat. Also, guys, um, your visceral fat is also from your stress most of the time. So, cortisol, cortisol level. So, there's that. Minsan, napapansin mo kahit nag diet, na parang yung puson mo or yung abdominal area mo. 
or visceral fat mong mataas pa rin can be also the stress. Sometimes wala na siya sa food. It's how you handle your stress. So you have to be able to find a way to de-stress, do meditation, yoga, anything that will relax you. Kahit na parang shallow minsan, like just, you know, put down your phone and just relax. Watch a funny, funny YouTube video. Anything that can make you relax. Play with so, the kids. Play with the kids. It's showing your kids to relax you. <laughs> <laughs> Trisha, thanks, Miss Kim. By the way, Storm really looks like you. Thank you. I think she looks like her that dad. She has my eyebrows. I hope you could extend branch here in UAE. Thank you so much. I am looking forward. I adore you, you, you both. Thank, Thank you, you so much for your love and support. We're looking forward to sending our products to you too. Hopefully soon. Annie Lala, hi to my forever girl crush. Hello, Annie. Hello, hello. Hi, Marie. Anything that you would want to add about um, ADF? Uh, there's a question there. Sorry, I did not see you. Any pregnancy fasting tips? Allergic Hi, Hi jo Joy C. Um, I would not recommend that you fast when you're pregnant. Again, um, I've been, I'm used to this and uh, I've been doing I was just doing 12 hour to 14 hours basically basic fasting and um, that's not something that I would recommend especially now that you're pregnant but you can do what you can do instead is eat nutrient-dense food incorporate good fat and avoid processed food anything with refined sugar so for the baby's development as well maganda na mag incorporate kind of good fat yan. maybe you can give advice post pregnancy Maybe on a different okay. ano. Mahaba, so sobrang dami ng advice. Yeah, because just just a little info. Um, after she gave birth to this one, she got back in shape in a week, less than a week. Mm -hmm. It was so impressive and it was a combination of diet and fasting. Anyway. Yeah. But I was breastfeeding, so it's not so I was <laughs> doing it with <laughs> fast. Fasting and, and I was eating I have two two healthy meals and then a lot of liquids for the of course breast milk thank you Glo glorious gracious gracious miss kim i'm scared na lalang pumayat if i fast for three days because people keep telling me that i lost a lot of weights uh, weight already since i stopped eating sugar and dairy already hi glorious you know what what's important is how you feel um, we all have different baseline. For example, like for me, I never reached my ideal weight. Um, dapat 125 ako or 130 based on the BMI. But that's not the weight that I'm, you know, I feel light and confident. And that matters to me. So we all have different requirements depending on, you know, your goals, for yeah. example. Um, and again, BMI is like based on... Uh, I don't want to say it, but can you say it for me? It's, it's no, the um, BMI is also based on a lot of Western standards. Yeah, so, so it's so Westernized. Bones and mass. It's a good, it's a good milestone to use. But for instance, in my case, I like to have more muscle, but Kim likes me skinnier. Ako gusto ko siya so, Yeah, not yeah, medyo. Or in my case, I like Kim with more weight and she likes to be thinner so yeah depending sa feel mo you have to listen to your body you uh -oh. if your energy is okay naman <laughs> and you're eating healthy then you know just should be fine and then if you don't want to lose more weight then you just make sure that you incorporate more nutrient dense food and not limit limit your um your food when you when you eat Basically, if you're, that's your fear, no? Con dumalaon or pano? Can you both take broth for meal replacement like every evening? Yes, definitely you can do that. That's what I was, I've been doing that as well, especially if I don't feel like eating, we'll just have broth. Yeah. That works. Samantha, hi ma'am, keep saying, hi Samantha. Okay. Hi, hi mamita. My Pi 168. I bought a walk pad Atticus. I hope it helps because I hit plateau. <laughs> go, go, go. Oh, is that Reg? Pi? I think. Let me check. Let yeah. me check later. Hi, Pi. Yeah, it. Um, 
try to use it when you binge watch and go slow like Kim walks at 3.5 so just you'll be on and have a day actually. Okay, it's not Reg, it's someone else. Someone else. But yeah, <laughs> yeah. Works really well. Obviously, I bought a walking pad too. Oh, you got Oh, wow. Awesome. I'm telling you, I should get a, com a mis commission what? from Xiaomi. <laughs> <laughs> po Chu. Hi, Miss Kim. I'm planning to do fast. Never tried anything. What you? What can you recommend? But I'm here in Mindanao and need buddy and products to ship here. I, and I cannot stop eating sugary stuff. Thank you. Hi, <laughs> Po Chu. Um, what I would recommend is, so if you're, you really have a sweet tooth no and you like uh, sugary stuff or sugary food what you can do is swap your clean your pantry first and remove the anything that has refined sugar and then replace it with coconut coconut sugar or um, you can replace it with stevia or mom fruit so those are your option first don't jump into just removing it right away because really it's unrealistic that's the same re reason why I tell people not like even for me, um, it took really like years before I was able to really be off my sugar addiction. Because yeah, before I was telling Ate kasi nga, the whole day, hindi ako kakain ng, ng any other meal except cake. Half, half ng malaking cake. Ganun kasama yung diet ko. And you know, hindi ako bothered kasi ang payat ko. So, but yun nga, as you get older and as I study more i've learned so many things that i was really doing a bad diet back then so uh yeah so basically i am more enlightened now and yeah for my kids as well it really helps especially for my kids like my my daughter has never tried mcdonald's you know so but you know the logo of Come mcdonald's closer, right Frame yourself. sorry there because i'm looking here sorry there so Pai, I got sh sh Xiaomi C1. Yeah. Hi, hi, Do you get stressed, you both? What do you do? Oh my god. Ako, yes, definitely. Oh my god. I'm stressed, guys. <laughs> Tell me your asawa ko. Can you tell them, Storm? Who's, who's more stressed, Mama or Papa? I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, spanky sometimes. <laughs> they both spank her sometimes. <laughs> okay, anything else? Hi, love. Love you. Yeah, anything you want to say? Anything that you want to say? Tell them, mm -hmm. guys, eat healthy to be strong and to live longer. Go. Stay healthy and sleep well, guys. So you can live longer. Yeah, very good. I lost 11 pounds in less than a month with your FMD. Week 1 and wow, week 3. Fantastic. Yeah, but once I reach my weight goal, it's AF, ADF. Best to... Oh, sorry, I can see the comments. Again, I don't want my metabolism to slow down and I want to go back to the gym. So basically what you can do via is to have a day a diet break we call it a diet break where you just eat whatever you want don't limit your calories that's how you ramp up your metabolism that's for mental health too if you've been at it for a while and you need to break it mental yeah, yeah. just relax and don't feel guilt, guilt guilty guilty about it no um i have some friends and people that i help um like they usually feel so bad when you know they eat unhealthy food i always tell this to people you can always start the following the following the following sorry the following day and no okay lang yan don't be too hard on yourself diba the inifabo 007 your healthy meal plan are super yummy kim the best I ever tried so far. Thank you so much. Please let us know if there's anything that you know we need to to improve para mas masarap, diba? And healthy, of course. When is the best time to drink melatonin? Mga fifteen to twenty minutes before you go to bed. Yeah. Or ako personally tinata because it's bedside ko. So by the time na pag patay ng ilaw yun, bago ko patay ng ilaw, pinatay ko na. Anything 
Uh, I like to drink my melatonin early. Ayaw niyong makinig sa akin. For you ba, mas e- effective yung ganun? Yeah, like, because I, I fight back to sleep. So, right after dinner, let's say I have, a di- I have dinner at 6, I'll take it around 7, and by 9 o'clock, I can't, I can't stay up anymore. Best time to take supplements when you're ADF. So, hi, Lila, or, yeah, Lila. It depends. Like, if you're doing a full-on ADF, alternate day fast, without any calories, I would recommend that you pause on your supplements first except melatonin, especially if you're having a difficulty in sleeping. But if you're taking like minimum 500 calories per day during your ADF, then you can take your fat-soluble supplements with your um, food, you know, 500 calories, and water-soluble so- supplements with, you know, without food, kahit without food by the end. Because there are two types of supplements, the fat-soluble and water-soluble, so there's that. Glorious G- Gracia so very very seldom but yung cheat niya galing sa KKK so happy na sila dun sa healthy cookies namin so yun Do we have ano yung um discount code can you get it from Oh okay we... yeah. You're most welcome Lila Kamusta kayo guys actually gusto kong gusto kong mag vlog about mental health during this pandemic. Parang ako lang ba yung nakaka-feel na parang minsan nakakalungkot na talaga. You feel nyo rin ba yun? Out of context, but yeah. I hope you guys are, you know, feeling okay. Do you think CBD oil is okay as an alternative for melatonin? Thea? Yes, I like it. Um... Kim likes it too. I love it. Okay, lang ba yun? <laughs> yeah. Hello from LA. That's my friend, Lixio. Yeah. Hold on. There. Hello from. I bought your frozen mino collagen with me, and I will start That's my the wife, I think. Oh, awesome! I'm excited. Regards to your husband. Cindy, Rella, O2. Is olive oil not good? But olive oil is good if it's not used for cooking. You can you can use it for cooking, but very low uh, fire lang, because it has a certain when once the once the oil reaches its its maximum boiling point, what happens is necessary yung composition, so you don't want that. Jenny Labiana, excited to try jumps up. I'm excited for you, Jenny. Trixie Languish. Yes, we will save this live. Francis, yes. <laughs> Glorious gr- Gracias. Sabi ko, parang gusto ko mag-vlog about mental health. Ako lang ba yung parang, iba yung oh. weird yung pakalamdam. <laughs> By the way, for Kim's recommendation on melatonin, uh, if you're fasting, if you're doing alternative fasting and you're taking melatonin to help you sleep, um, make sure it's not the one that's sweetened. Yeah, kasi may mga, yung mga gummies, guys, Marami ako nakikita, pinapromote nila yung supplements, even for weight loss, yung mga gummies. But if you check the ingredients, it can do more harm than good. Um, so, wag tayo sa short-term solution. Because at the end of the day, maglalaban yung katawan mo. If it's not like something that will really help you with your health, I would not recommend it. It's a very, um, it's not advisable to take those pills or gummies. And then Okay, hold on, we'll just Okay, see. and then um BC Nunes started with your broth. Does it have contradiction? No, it should be okay to take. I would want to know though if you're taking any supplements or medication. That's what's important. Francis, do you take powder collagen? What brand would you recommend? Um Neocell is a good brand. AG Twazon. Yes, twenty twenty vision go. Hello, gorgeous couple. Not ADF related. Tried FMD, but I noticed I had trouble sleeping, especially on the first two nights because FedEx felt better on the third day, though. Is this okay? Yes. yes usually, that's yeah, especially. Sugar. If, yeah, especially if you're coming from uh, a not so clean diet, then you usually feel that, or if you're dehydrated. So you have to make sure that you're hydrated during your fasting. So, guys, 
um, thank you so much. We, we have to kind of wrap up. Yeah, the kids are waiting. Usually, we eat between 5.30 to 6 p.m. But I told the, the staff to wait for for us. Matapos to. Kasi gusto namin sabayan yung kids. So, again, thank you so much for your time. We are so happy to see everyone virtually uh, online. Hold on, ah. And for those who attended and here right now, we would want to give you uh, a discount no, that you can use. So let me type it here. Discount. Yep. Let's help people so they can jumpstart their health. It's 15% off. Hold on. Let me let me type it here. Mama, I'm not allowed to write sleep there. <laughs> what do you want to... God hero. Sleep? What do you want to type? Uh, sleep? Hold on. Sleep well. Uh, sleep well. You want Aww, to sleep well. Get 15... Storm said sleep well. Percent off. Use. God. Sorry, I type so slow. There you go. See? You want to type? Oh, see, there. there. I'm sleep well. Okay. Oh, there you type, darling. You, can, you know how to spell now, right? Where's that? Yeah, very good. Okay. And then. Sorry, this, this one. This one. Yeah, it looks different about there. See? Uh, where's pa, pa? Pa, pa, there. Space bar? Space. There's space a space. Bar. Yep. Well. Wow. Okay, one more. Okay, okay you can post. click post. Yep. Oh my god, that's your second comment. Yung first comment niya dun sa kanyang School. bouncy school. Oh, oh. That's Storm's <laughs> comment. Good job, Storm. Good job, my darling. <laughs> yeah, I love you. Say so you love you, everyone. You I stay... Love so you love you everyone, stay I safe love, and healthy. I love you everyone, stay stay healthy. Yeah. Bye guys, Bye happy everyone. weekend. Have a great weekend, stay safe, stay sane. Bye.